nine on your side first warning weather with chief meteorologist Aaron Christensen. Well, here we are. It's Thursday and for the fifth day in a row now we've had a pretty steady stream of cloud cover and we still have that cloud cover at the airport with 82 degrees overnight. Partly cloudy 58 for Tucson tomorrow. Partly cloudy with a 10% chance for rain sprinkled in and 84 degrees our high temperature. So we do have a slim chance of rain. Uh, thunderstorms possible come tomorrow. I'll tell you where in just a bit. Also the 80 sticking around through our Saturday, but the warm up resumes next week. Yeah, I'll have that seven day forecast for you. So right now our high temp 84 in Tucson, 74 today for Oracle, 77 Wilcox. Temperature still running about five degrees below normal for all of Southern Arizona. That does include that 84 degrees we had today. We should be at about 89. That's our 30 year average for the airport. But interestingly enough, our morning lows have been pretty close to normal. We were at 58 degrees this morning. The average morning low is 59. When we take a step back, we look at the big picture here across the desert southwest. This storm system to our north, it's kind of pesky. It's just been sticking around, not really moving a whole lot. We don't have anything um, moving in to kind of kick it out of this position. And it looks oh so promising, doesn't it? Across this view, quite a few showers here from Kingman up through Flagstaff, Page, over to Sholo, even into New Mexico. But when we zoom into southern Arizona, still mostly dry, with the exception of those showers developing over Graham County that we had pointed out out earlier. The other thing that I have in this uh, particular graphic, you're seeing some lightning strikes off into New Mexico over there. I wanted to check out the potential for lightning over Graham County. Uh, you know, it's, we're getting into that time of year. We start seeing some thunderstorms developing, but we're still quite dry. The last thing we want are lightning sparked fires uh, already across Graham County where we have a fire that is currently burning. So the good news is we're not seeing any lightning strikes, at least at this point. Our highs tomorrow, though, still below normal. Normal and still in the 80s for most of us. 82 for Oral Valley, 83 Green Valley, 79 though for Benson, 72 Bisbee, and 81 in Safford. So as we head through the next 48 hours, we have several chances for rain tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow night, Saturday afternoon, and Saturday night. So through Saturday evening, eastern Pima County, far eastern Pima County, we're talking over the Rincons, the Catalinas primarily, 10% uh, chance for rain. Can't rule out a sprinkle or two even in the Tucson metro area. Better chance at 20% across Cochise County and a 30% chance for showers and thunderstorms across Graham County. So the rest of our weekend here in Tucson, again, just that 10% chance for rain tomorrow, tomorrow night through basically all the way through Saturday night. And our temps do warm from 84 Friday, 89 Saturday to 93 for Mother's Day. A look at the extended Kagan on in your side seven day forecast. That warming trend does start Sunday and it continues all the way through next work week. By this time next week, we'll be talking temps in the upper 90s to near 100. Kagan on in your side at five o'clock. We'll be right back.